in time you will help them accomplish wonders. Welcome to our second Trailer Trash episode. We will be doing Man of Steel because the third trailer was just released yesterday. And holy shit. And holy shit. I dreamed of becoming something other than what society had intended. Uh, I'm David. I'm Hector. And uh, what a trailer. Uh, lots to talk about on this one. Um, Russell Crowe is shown a little bit more. He seems like the perfect Jarrell. Um... Marlon Brando is gone forever, so he can't do it again. Um, it just it looks great. Uh, the design is totally changed. You're so used to the, you know the, um, for instance, the Fortress of Solitude being you know the jagged pinnacle in the Antarctica, or North Pole, or is it South Pole? I don't Pole? fucking know. Antarctica. Uh, <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> but you're, you're so used to that jaggedness, and now it's all circular and futuristic and modernized. And it looked pretty badass. Well, I mean, it, it, from what we saw, it looked pretty cool. You will give the people of Earth an ideal to strive towards. Cool so far. I think everything's going to fit into place, but it's still a little jarring for people that are fans of the original. Um, Zod. You believe your son is safe? I will find him! Oh my god, he looks like he needs to get back into the Phantom Zone ASAP because he is starting some shit. <laughs> uh, yeah. Um, but Michael Shannon looks like he's perfect for the role. Michael right? Shannon is one of my favorite actors. He's pretty fucking cool. He was great in Goodfellas. God, Goodfellas. But uh, he looks great in this too. Um, then we have uh, a Amy Adams. Well, here is an S. How about... See. Amy Adams is my, well, not my favorite actress, but she's one of my favorite actresses. And she, I feel like she's going to help this one a lot. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Um, and then, last but not least, uh, Kevin Costner. Son, you're the answer to Are We Alone in the Universe. Can I just keep pretending I'm your son? You are my son. Where has he been? I don't know. In Idaho, or working I, with Zac Efron or something. I don't Ooh, fucking know. That movie Zac Efron. Pretty bad. Um, but he he looks like he's perfect for the role. I mean, he kind of has that like he's bringing the old Superman into the new Superman in a way. Unless I mean, you're gonna say he has that dad quality. Yeah, that dad quality. But you know how uh, the dad in the first one was like, "You are here for a reason." I mean, he has basically a similar exact line. Mm -hmm. I would say. Um, Overall, we're going to go see this at midnight. It's pretty obvious. I yeah, think it's all pretty America freaking has. obvious. There's, it's going to be a big, big one. Yeah. Um, if it's not the highest grossing movie of the year, it will definitely be in the top five. Uh, Iron Man might have a little bit more of a chance, but we're we're seeing this midnight release. Midnight uh, after midnight will be right after it, and stay tuned for that. Yes, I do have an issue with this movie though. I'm What's a little that? worried. What's that guy's name that plays Superman? Um, Harvey Cavill or something, or Henry Cavill. It's Henry Cavill. Is Some, he was a guardian angel. For others, a ghost who never quite fit in. That's HC. Right. <laughs> we'll call him an HC. We'll call him HC. Um, he was in Immortals. Ah, uh, yeah. Uh, and damn, that movie was bad. Very bad. Um, so, uh, but, uh, but he is working with Amy, and he's working with a lot of like seasoned actors you know? yes so that hopefully that will make it better a lot <laughs> uh, and, 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 honestly we can go into a lot more depth especially with the design of Krypton he seems good so far yeah FYI disclaimer if this movie does not work Superman movies cannot work period because they have put so much money and effort into this movie and right now it's a test if Superman is a relevant character anymore. I have high hopes Christopher Nolan's like a producer in this so and writer I have, I have a lot of high hopes. Yeah. With David Goyer. Um, and then Zack Snyder, he has his ups and downs. But 
if he's if his visual mind is like kind of put like, hey, calm down, sir. I it well see that's good. that's the thing because I think he's Nolan and everybody who's a part of this is like, hey, focus, you know, focus, <laughs> yeah. hey, you know, like focus. <laughs> Don't so do that it, crazy <laughs> shit. <laughs> it's <laughs> probably gonna work really well. Mm. And I think it's gonna be really good. So I'm really excited. Um, midnight release. I cannot freak. I'm like freaking excited. I want to do after midnight so bad. Like tomorrow and yeah, can't. Unfortunately, it's not out until sometime in May, maybe June. I don't no, fucking know. We'll It'll put probably it right here. It's like. <laughs> Anyways, thanks for watching. I will race behind you. I will stumble. I will fall. But in time, they will join you in the sun. In time, you will help them accomplish wonders. And as always, comment down below, subscribe to the channel, and post some comments down there with some likes, you know. And while you're down there.